I'm now a sports ground contractor and uh, work on uh, football, rugby, horse racing, tennis, and uh, we also build some s synthetic pitches. We have something just under 40 tractors and because all the work tends to happen at the same time, there's the seasons, I need to be able to plan each job and to equip each job with everything. So everything's in a hurry, everything has got to be ready for the following season, so each project has to have a set of equipment to carry it out. Yes, I would be reluctant uh, to buy a second-hand big name because I don't know really how badly it's been treated prior to getting it. Uh, the armor track, the thing that attracted me, I think, first was the Perkins engine. And uh, I read about the Perkins engine and then the proprietary quality gearbox. So it gave me confidence to sort of consider them. And seeing them in the flesh, I thought, yes, why not? It's just over two years ago, the first one. I think I bought three, actually, all at once. Um, and... Um, then we subsequently bought um, three more. They're very handy, they're very easy to use, very uncomplicated, they're very simply made, you can understand them. In some respects, very similar to the early Massey Ferguson 135s. Um, they don't, uh, don't do unpredictable things. There's an absence of electronics, and that was one of the major attractions, the Perkins engine and the Carrero gearbox and the um, absence of electronics.